Welcome, welcome. How y'all doing? It's Derek two times. I'm here to let y'all know about my Dell Inspiring 5680. This is my first gaming computer. It got the blue backlight. This thing here is lit. You guys rocking with the Intel Core processor, the i5. Got the eight gigabytes of memory, one TV hard drive. Today, we'll be installing a, a hard drive solid state uh, to increase the speed. Uh, super, too bad they didn't get the option to upgrade, so I didn't have to do no upgrade on a brand new computer. But yeah, that's what we got going on. Let me take y'all to see what's going on inside this Dell Inspiring 5680. All right, y'all, before you uh, remove that internal hard drive and install your solid state uh, M2 hard drive, you wanna back up your, um, your current settings on your computer. Cause uh, what you wanna do is uh, install Windows um, 7 uh, ISO program on a flash drive. So when you, when you put in your new hard drive, you're gonna install Windows back onto the uh, new uh, hard drive. <coughs> All right, y'all, here we go. We got the, uh, the glass side panel here off. Got the computer laying on its side. We're just trying to prep everything. My shit got on my screwdrivers. Make sure everything all set up. Just the, uh, the M2 SSD uh, hard drive card. Of course, it doesn't have the screw to bolt it now. All right, we'll find a screw to put in there. All right, a uh, little like this bracket that's covering over, that's holding the uh, the graphics card up. It's gonna have to come out. Get it. There you go. Remove that plate that's holding the graphics card. And then you're gonna go over to the graphics card and take those two screws out. And do make sure you put your screws up so you don't lose them. Take those two screws out. It is a clip that's holding the graphics card. You probably do want to make sure you push that clip back while you pull it up on the graphics card to release it. I kind of didn't, I forgot about the clip. It's moving too fast. Oh yeah. Easy work. Just take your time. You ain't gotta move fast. Oh, got a message. My bad. Sorry about that. Alright, yep, there you go. Just take your time and wiggle it out. Do make sure you hit that clip that's up under the uh oh, see, heard that snap. Yep, trying to break stuff already. Yeah, it's a clip that hold on to that little hook by the bottom of the graphics card. But everything's all right. Still popping and popping and locking. Got to be more kept. That's the uh, Nevada GTX. Um, I think it was like 1060, three gigabytes. I'm guessing that's the uh, the top of the line graphics card. 
for right now and gets the job done. I got no problems with it. I'm loving it. Right now, um, there's no screw that came with the M2 car, and there's no extra screw inside the panel, which is weird. I'm guessing you weren't supposed to upgrade, or there were no extra parts that came in the box, no extra screws. So, all right, here it is. Here's the M2 SSD solid state. Uh, hard, um, dang, sorry. Uh, hard drive, 250 gigabytes. Um, sliding it in the, uh, M2 slot. I still don't understand why no screw came with it, but, uh, I do have some, uh, extra screws. I'm, uh, trying to figure out what's going on. I'm trying to check it out, make sure it's not touching nothing, not shorting out. You don't want no problems. You know, that's that. That's that QA, that high quality service. You know what I'm saying? I used to, I used to manufacture these things, you know? I wish I could. But, uh, yeah. So just checking out, make sure everything, double checking, triple checking, triple checking, double checking, everything look good. You know? All right now, all right now, did, did he ever stick the card in there? All right, we got the card in there. We got the M2 card in there. It slid in there with no problems. It's just sticking up in the air a little bit. We're going to put that screw in there to lock it down. You know what I'm saying? Put the screw in there, make sure the washer wasn't too big. Alright y'all, we got them we got them big old hands up in now, putting that MM2 card in there. You got it locked down. That's for sure. Alright y'all, I found the right size screw. I gotta see if I got see if I can put both of my hands in there. It's kinda tight. But you know, I'm, I'm gonna get it. I ain't got no problems with it. Gotta get done. Um, you know what I mean? Gotta make sure that, that card get in there, get it locked in, secure, it don't move. So we're gonna have no short. I don't want to blow up my $800 computer. We almost there. We almost there. So we got that locked down. Now we installed the reverse process when you uh, took everything out. So the last thing was the memory was the graphics card. So we're gonna put the graphics card back in. Line it up, make sure it clip back into that clip. All right. All right, now we're gonna uh, install this bracket back over the graphics card. So the graphic cards stay in the spot. So when you put in uh, the bracket back in, just make sure you're not hitting the board. Make sure everything nice and tight. Oh, got my head in the way again. But we're just putting back the bracket uh, to hold on to the graphics card. All right, all right. We're getting them screws locked into we'll place. Nope, we finished. That's it. That is it. We just got to plug it back, plug the graphics card back in. Finish tightening up those screws. All right, now we got the solid state hard drive installed into the computer. So now we're gonna put the uh, the Windows 7 um, onto the uh, new hard drive. We're gonna install all the information on there. Here we go. So far, everything's good. It works good. You know what I'm saying? I need to try to uh, apply for Geek Squad at uh, Best Buy, man. 
So, here we go. And we're just gonna speed through this. All right, we almost finished downloading. A couple more seconds. All right, it just finished. All right, Dell rebooting up. All right, Windows coming up. Come on, come on, come on. I know I'm professional. Look at here. Y'all ain't ready. Did it work? Did it work? Did it work? Did it work? Oh, it's loading. It's loading. It's lo Bam. That's when you pop real quick. Oh, bam. There we go, baby. We're getting ready. We're getting ready to load up. This is uh, Windows Windows 7 loading for the first time on the SS solid state hard drive. Giving it a little time, it's thinking, it's thinking, it's thinking. There we go, there we go. All right, y'all. We finally got everything loading. We got the Dell logo. Load it up real pretty quick. Got the logo again. All right, we got the window symbol, and we loading. We loading again. We loading. This is the first time it's booting up. Yep, they go Windows. Just a moment. Everything's loading. I mean, it is moving a lot quicker. I mean, it's like pop, 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 pop. It is moving a lot quicker. And uh, I guess this here is, this is just a setup. When I reset up Windows, you know, you sign into your Microsoft account. You know, everything is preloaded. You know you yes, y'all, that's it. We've upgraded the Dell Inspiring 5680 um, desktop computer from uh, a regular hard drive, one TB hard drive, to a solid state hard drive, 256 gigabytes. Um, yes, we are loading programs a lot faster. Uh, downloading through the Wi-Fi is a little bit slow, but uh, you know, taking care of one problem at a time. I do appreciate you watching my video. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.